Miss Greenlee, is she better? Is there any change? Well, she won't eat. She barely speaks. Yeah. She needs some time. Yeah. It's like something's missing inside. It's like nothing matters anymore. We're going to help her. Yeah. You don't suppose Kim is right. I mean, without Ryan's baby, is Greenlee really lost? Stop making me say it, Kendall. You can't give me my baby back. Not the baby that you lost. Another one. Your baby with Ryan. I can give it to you. Your baby. My belly. I give birth for you. You have your child. Excuse me. I hope I'm not intruding. Well, no, no, of course not. I mean, we're just going around around in circles trying to figure out how to help Greenlee. I mean, this is killing us to see her like this. Well, the worst is over as far as I'm concerned. I just wish Greenlee would see that. Well, all she sees now is her loss, but that will change. But it seems that she doesn't even want to be reached, and we don't want to see her slip away any further. Well, maybe she doesn't have to. What do you mean? Greenlee doesn't have to carry her child. Maybe someone else can do that for her. How can you say such twisted garbage? Did you expect me to fall for something like this? Okay, all right, listen, let's slow down, okay? Listen to what I'm saying to you. I just told you that I would carry your baby, yours and Ryan's baby. You must really hate me to stick pins in me like this. I mean, I've done a lot to you, but aren't we even yet? No, no, Greenlee, we were even a long time ago. Are you really going to lie to me about carrying my baby to make me feel better? That's just wrong. I'm supposed to get all upbeat and hopeful and not notice you toting around a bag of sugar or that pregnancy pooch you used with Bianca. Queenly, do you honestly think that after all the hell you've been through, I would sit here and try to play you? Enough. Ryan's child will never be a part of this world. Just stop it. Greenly, come on, I'm not an idiot. I wouldn't try to fake a pregnancy. Again. Listen, I talked to Dr. Madden. We have Ryan's sperm, your eggs, and my womb. This is actually possible. This is for real. Dr. Madden said it could work. Yeah. Someone else could carry my baby with Ryan. And you're volunteering. Yeah, I mean, you're my best friend. Now you're my sister. If you would just stop attacking me, we could actually do this. Big leap of faith you expect me to take. Yeah, well, you'll thank me next year when you pull up a high chair at Thanksgiving dinner. To risk like that again, to hope like that again, I just don't think I can go through yes, it. Yes, yes, Creamly, yes, you can. Come on. You are the ultimate risker. You're, you're, you're the risk taker. You live on pure hope and confidence. That's who you are. Ryan used to say he loved that about me. Your child will say the exact same thing. <laughs>